Welcome. There are many videos on YouTube dealing with the VSDC editor and how to do green screens. This video will display techniques on multi-layering of green screens only. When the editor opens and you select new project, use the 16:9 widescreen settings. Most video sites accept this size now. I recommend setting the editor table to a smaller size, somewhere around 17%, in case some of your images go off the editor. To get started, select your background scene. The most important thing that you will learn is the sequence of layers requires pre-planning to avoid any problems. To avoid confusion, keep all of your scenes in a separate folder. Continue placing the other layers on the editor. Alignment is important. Our layers are for instructional purposes only, where yours will have meaning. The layers were selected to show variety. When you have all of your scenes added, you now must move the green screen background to the top layer to make it transparent. Right click your mouse on the background image and select top. Here you can make the background transparent. I like to use the eyedropper to correctly record the background color of the green screen.
when you are finished with the images on the editor and you save the project you can still add more layers like a green screen image of a logo watermark in the lower right of the screen This green screen layering technique can be used for many other projects. If anything, I hope that I have triggered your creative juices on your next project. Create and have fun. So, uh...